Neil Battaglia, SaxStation.com. The other day I was watching a video class from Carlos Santana, and he was talking about a lot of different things, actually. But one thing he was talking about was learning the song Night Train, James Brown. And he was saying how he would learn the melody, he would look at the bass line, he'd look at the guitar part, he learned different things that all the instruments were doing in the song. And I thought about that idea, and I thought it was pretty cool. And if you understand the rest of the song, like every piece, you kind of see how they connect with each other. If you can play the piano part, you can play the bass part, you can play the drums, you're going to have a really a lot better idea of how the song goes, and you're probably going to sound better on sax. And when you're practicing, you can kind of have these parts going in the back of your head too. So with Night Train, James Brown starts off by saying, I'll aboard the Night Train. And then the guitar comes in with this line. It's just guitar for a little while. And then the other instruments kind of start to join in. So I went ahead and learned that guitar line on sax. Even though you have saxophone parts later on, I decided I'd learn the guitar part because it sounds cool and it's part of the song. So it starts on tenor on a B flat. B flat, B flat with the octave key, G, A flat, G, F, G, and that line repeats. Then later on it's going to go up a fourth and a fifth, like the blues changes. <laughs> Try getting this first one and then realize that the other ones are going to be pretty similar. They're going to be maybe slightly different and there's going to be like transition notes. But it basically kind of does the same pattern in a few different keys that go along with the changes. If you like this video, go ahead and like and subscribe. And you can check out more of what I'm doing on saxstation.com. Hey.